So we have been prepping our bathroom area. We did a primer coat yesterday over all the sheetrock. And now we've been plasticking off the floor and all the switches and things in preparation. See the fan up there? In preparation for texture. So that is what we're doing today. We're in the bathroom today where yesterday, as you saw, we were texturing and we've let that dry a good 24 hours. And now we're gonna start painting. Um, our color is the same color we've used throughout the house. It's called paper white. So it's kind of an off white, kind of with a yellow cast, depending on the light uh, when you look at it. But let me show you the texture. So I'm not sure how well this is gonna <laughs> come across. Um, if you can see the texture, you can probably see it better, the overspray that we've got around the shower that we did plastic on. And there's not great light in here right now because we're got the uh, light plugged up so we wouldn't paint that. So... There. Maybe that's a good view. You can see what the te texture is like. So it's not super light. It's not super heavy though either. I think it'll be just right. I can't even tell. I can oh, see. I no, I can't even see. Oh, my from an angle, I can. Oh boy, I can't tell. I'm, just, I'm lost. I can't. Yep, yeah, right there. <clears throat> Should we try and set up that other light, or would that just make it worse? I don't know. I mean, I, I literally can't see. <laughs> we got the paint, the first coat of the final color, this paper white by Sherwin Williams is on the walls. I know it's hard to see because we don't have great lighting other than these spotlights. Um, but I'll maybe show. <laughs> so Tom got it rolled and I cut in the corners and edges. So I think it's looking pretty good. You'll just have to trust my word for it <laughs> until we uh, get uh, some proper light fixtures and stuff in here. So our bathroom vanity got delivered and installed today. I'm really happy about it. You can see it's got just a single sink. We've got some plumbing stuff here we'll be working on. And then we'll have a vanity light, you know, like a few drop lights and a mirror eventually. But for now we have the sink and I'll have plenty of counter space. And I really like, um, we've got some dust here still, but er, stuff I think from him putting the poles on. Um, this nice deep drawer, I wanted this to put like bath towels because there won't be a linen closet per se down here so we can have extra towels in there and then a more normal size drawer here that has the same um, treatment as our other cabinets throughout the house and then because this one is a flat, you know, this is like your fake <laughs> drawer. You can't really do a drawer where there's a sink. Then this one matches that. So this one is a working drawer. 
So really excited to see the bathroom, at any rate, come together. So we'll be getting plumbing hooked up and we're gonna start working on the flooring, I think soon. And then we can attach the toilet and uh, hopefully finish out all the plumbing, hook up the shower and all of that. So making progress. Here's our progress on the sanding. We did a lot uh, last week or so on the walls. And I can't take credit, of course. <laughs> Tom did most of it, but um, I did on the weekend do a lot of the screw, um, screw heads and got those flattened out. And then Tom's working on all of the joints where the joint compound has tape over it. Um, but we're making progress. Our goal is to try and get this hallway and the family room area all sanded hardest part is the ceiling because it's nine foot ceilings and to really feel like you're doing it right you got to get all the way up there so that makes it really hard but our goal like I said is to try and get family room and the hallway ready for primer in this next week we have just got so much dust into the basement uh, and tried to sweep it but there was just so much built up from all the sanding of the drywall that the most efficient ways really was getting out the air compressor and just blowing all that dust out so you can see here Tom's working hard to get the sand off of the walls and then just keep blowing <laughs> as he goes here and get the floor and everything and get it all cleaned out so we can start painting next.
so we ha now have a painted family room. Really excited after a lot of long hours and much painting and uh, texturing. We finally have the family room just about done. Let me show you. So it might be a little hard to tell. It's uh, some light, it looks white, but it's really uh, paper white, so it has a yellow cast. You can probably tell easier on this piece. Then the wall behind looks kind of white through the lens at least. So this whole space is painted, ceiling and walls. Just gotta hook back up the lights properly. <laughs> And I just cut in the corners down the hall so that Tom can continue with the roller tomorrow, but it's almost done. So really excited that we can check this room off and continue now with the bedroom and the stairwell will probably be last but you can see we've got the texture on there now as well as the paint so thanks for following along on our journey and we'll continue on and have uh, some more content for you i don't want to bore you with too much sanding and texture and painting but uh, we have some projects. Once we get beyond that, we've got to do flooring and other things. So stay tuned. It's the Northern Lights. Beautiful greens and pinks in the sky. And a sliver of the moon just starting to go down behind the mountain.